think I was always invested in the butterfly from the very beginning. As soon as I heard about it, I knew we needed this. What I like about a butterfly project is having more happy moments and making every moment matter. I love the project. It has gone a long way to do in the life of the residents because of how the residents uh, behave before, the way they interact with each other. It actually brought them together as a family. The entire team has has really pushed to challenge themselves to reflect on what it means to really provide true person-centered care. And there's been an incredible effort from every member of our team to show up in their own clothing, to show up with new and fun ideas. They've been supports for each other and certainly for the people living here and for the people visiting here. I couldn't be more proud. There are residents, you know, prior to the project that they wake up, they, we give them care, they sit in the chair and they're just there. Maybe they're sleeping or the TV's on and they're not paying attention. But with the project now, you have to engage with this residence. You hold hands, maybe you might be singing or might be, you might be playing a song on the iPad and then the resident perk up. They open their eyes, they're able to talk to you. We have our residents who like to set the table and prepare for mealtimes, who fold all the napkins and the, the shirt protectors and the towels for everyone. Residents who like to bake and cook and every day there's an opportunity they make something and they share with the staff and with the residents to eat. We have our residents who haven't played a piano in a very long time and now will play the piano, have started knitting again, have started doing art again. It had one resident, I never thought she could have speak, but as the project go on and you're engaging with those type of residents, you're surprised to know that they're able to say a few words. And then when you see that change in the residents, then you know that there's still someone under that disease. When you come onto the Willowville floor, you feel energy, there's things going on, there's music. With the change in the color, the lighting, you're seeing pictures on the wall, you're seeing there's a nice couch. So when you step onto the neighborhood, you'll be like, oh wow. When you see the colors, it feels more like home. We've seen the space transform from a place that was rather cold and clinical to something that feels so warm, so inviting, so bright, so welcoming. And we've seen some of our quieter residents really come alive again to the sound of music and activities and wouldn't have imagined were possible before the Butterfly Project. I was struck by how people have come alive. There was life in Willow Vale. Connections were seen, felt and heard. Everybody was doing something with purpose and togetherness. Team members and people living in the home were able to simply be together like old friends. It's really amazing to see the staff really enjoy their work and enjoy forming better relationships with the residents and be able to almost feel at home themselves when they're in the setting. They're still able to get their work done, but it's more enjoyable, it's more relaxed, and it's more person-centered. We've been having a lot of more interaction and more laughter and more conversations with the staff and residents and family. It's not just about us going to work, but it's something that the residents would always looking forward to having that homey and having family in the neighborhood that they get to see every day. The most special feedback that I had from one of the residents is that when she came into the home, she was coming in with failure to thrive and she just wanted to lay in her bed and didn't really want to do anything. In her words, her experience on the butterfly floor has given her a chance to live. She feels that she has an improved quality of life and she considers herself blessed to be here, otherwise she would not be here. So when you see your impact of changing the direction of your care and putting the residence First and foremost, I'm getting emotional here. It, it truly makes a difference. Seeing how different the residents are now. From when we started to now, they're not the same people anymore. We're not the same people anymore. We've really changed. Six months ago, some of these people were napping and 
really were not interested in anything that was happening around them. And now when you go up, you see a big smile on their face and they're interacting and they're baking and they're cooking and they're looking for an opportunity to have a conversation with each other. And there's like real friendships happening in the neighborhood, like real connection. And sometimes you have to sit back and go, wow, look at what we did.